Hello and welcome to Neurotech Lectures. If you haven't watched our previous videos, please make sure to watch them first. Today our topic is deoxyribonucleic acid. Before describing this topic, I would like to suggest you a channel that is Yatharth Classes. Please check out this channel. This channel has good contents regarding biology and make sure to subscribe it. Okay, so let's move toward the topic. Deoxyribonucleic acid, also abbreviated as DNA, is principal informational macromolecule of the cell, which stores, translates, and transfers the genetic information. In prokaryotes, the DNA is found mostly in nuclear zone, whereas in eukaryotes, it is found in nucleus, mitochondria, and chloroplast. How DNA was discovered? DNA was discovered in 1869 by Swiss researcher Frederick Meister. He was originally trying to study the composition of lymphoid cells. The DNA were named nuclein because it was isolated from nuclei of cells. Later in 1889, Richard Altman discovered that nuclein had acidic properties and it was named as nucleic acid. After many years of discoveries by different scientists, in 1953, Watson and Crick built a 3D model of DNA which satisfied all the details. Watson and Crick were awarded with Nobel Prize in 1962. Structure and Composition of DNA DNA is a double helix molecule the DNA molecule is composed of two polynucleotide chains, which are composed of monomeric units called nucleotide. The nucleotide is basic building block of DNA. It is monomer of nucleic acid. The nucleotide is further made up of three major molecules. These are 5-carbon deoxyribosugar, phosphate group and nitrogenous bases. Let's discuss them individually. Deoxyribose sugar. The name DNA is assigned from deoxyribose sugar, which has molecular formula as C5H10O4. The deoxyribose sugar molecule lacks one oxygen atom, hence it is called deoxyribose. The nitrogenous bases. There are four different bases. These are adenine, guanine, cytosine and thymine. And third component of nucleotide is phosphate molecule. Phosphate is bonded with four oxygen atoms. Phosphate becomes negative charged due to high electronegativity of oxygen atoms. Therefore, DNA has also negative charge on it. How nucleotides are joined together? The carbon atoms of 5 carbon deoxyribose are numbered 1 prime, 2 prime, 3 prime, 4 prime, and 5 prime. The fifth carbon atom of one nucleotide is combined with phosphate group by ester bond. The same phosphate group is bonded with third carbon of second molecule making ester bond again. Hence, two nucleotides are bonded by phosphodiester bond. The phosphodiester bonding between nucleotides form the sugar phosphate backbone. This provides orientation or directionality to the DNA. Here direction is 5' prime to 3'. Prime. Two strands of DNA are oriented opposite in direction, hence they are anti-parallel. Complementary base pairing. The one strand is component of other, which means a particular purine base pairs with pyrimidine base. Adenine joins with thymine by two hydrogen bonds and cytosine joins with guanine by three hydrogen bonds. And two strands are bonded by hydrogen bonds. In this strand, thymine bonds with adenine, guanine with cytosine, adenine with thymine, cytosine with guanine, likewise. Thousands of nucleotides bond and form the structure of DNA molecule. Functions of DNA in a simple language, we can say that functions of DNA is to store and transfer information, just like our computer. DNA codes for various proteins and regulates gene expression. Sometimes DNA is degraded enzymatically and it is used as source of nucleosides and nucleotides for the needs of cell. 
थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग आई होप यू फाउंड दिस वीडियो हेल्पफुल